Good morning, Morning, Lancaster Catholic. Catholic. I'm Justin Sharon. And I'm Annie Scan. Today is Thursday, March 12th, 2015. Day B, Rotation 9-8. Clubs and meetings. Senior class gift committee meets today during sixth period. Bring your lunch to the conference room. Mock trial members, please remember black binders with all case material to miss stemming by the end of this week. Join global group members in a table tennis competition against Lancaster Mennonite High School today from 3 to 4 in the cafeteria. College visits this week. Friday, Marywood University, Scranton at 9 a.m. in the school's counseling office. General announcements. Minithon dancers meet again tomorrow at the end of lunch. Listen at lunch for instructions to meet in Burger Gym for more information on your Minithon. Speaking of Minithon, here's your chance to eat wings and help raise money for kids suffering from pediatric cancer. On Monday, March 16th, all day long, Minithon is hosting a Buffalo Wild Wings night. Just bring in your flyer from Homeroom or print one from the LCHS homepage, and 10% of your bill will be donated towards our Minithon. Remember, it's for the kids. Tomorrow is the last day to buy your tickets to the Sadie Hawkins dance. They cost $8, and they won't be sold at the door Saturday night. If you are bringing a guest from another school, you must get a permission form signed by Mrs. Howe and return to Miss Malloy by today. Also, the guys on the old sport court will be collecting money at both lunches for the rest of the week. Be sure to help out your favorite senior boy to win free prom tickets. The big dance is more than six weeks away, but Mariana Torres is here with a different way to shop for your prom gown. Prom season is right around the corner with exactly 50 days until the night of nights. And you know what that means? Promposals, corsages, and of course, dresses. Finding the perfect dress can be quite a challenge, especially when deciding how much to spend. Studies show that the average cost of prom is a whopping $1,139. So it's not hard to see how some people might find prom to be a bit of a stretch financially. So for some, spending money on a prom dress and accessories just isn't possible. But that's where the organization Becca's Closet comes to the rescue. Becca's Closet donates prom dresses and accessories to high school girls with financial need. Not only is this about dresses, it's about giving girls the opportunity to make their prom a night to remember. Becca's Closet is centered in Florida, but has various chapters around the country. One is right here in Pennsylvania. Becca's Closet will be hosting an event in Doylestown, PA on the 22nd of March from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. It's the opportunity for girls who thought they wouldn't be able to afford a dress to pick out the prom dress of their dreams. The only requirement is that you bring your school student ID. For more information about how you can attend one of these events or donate a dress, go to beckettscloset.org. Next Tuesday, March 17th, LCHS will host 6th through 8th graders for our Partner Schools event, previously scheduled for Catholic Schools Week. Be sure to know your homeroom's assignment for the day. You can wear a t-shirt from your Partner Elementary School or your LCHS t-shirt that day. Also next Tuesday, the math department will be celebrating Pi Day. Students, faculty, and staff are invited to bring in canned goods which will be used in classroom activities and then donated to San Juan Baptista Food Drive just in time for Easter. Learn more math and feed the hungry this St. Patrick's Day. And this message for students involved in the Good Samaritan program. Your documentation forms are to be returned to your homeroom moderators only. Don't give them to Mr. Rogers or put them in his mailbox. 25 junior and senior girls are needed to help out with Lancaster Catholic's Prayer and Care Day On Saturday, April 11th, volunteers are needed from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and escorting people from event to event and serving lunch. Please sign up outside of Mr. Rogers' room ASAP. And 10 to 12 strong guys are needed after school Friday, April 10th to set up tables for the event. Here's a great opportunity for Good Samaritan hours. Sign-up sheets are outside Mr. Rogers' office. Congratulations to senior Kate Caracella. She won first place for her historical paper in the National History Day Regional Competition, held on Saturday, March 7th. Her paper on the architectural legacy of Daniel Burnham won first place in the competition that attracted entries from Berks, Lancaster, Lebanon, and York counties. 
Kate has qualified for the Pennsylvania State History Day competition that will be held at Millersville University in May. Have, Have a, a great, great day, Crusaders. Crusaders. Dream is to fly over the rainbow so high